Hey, hey guys, welcome back to Vlogmas. Today is a fun video. This video is going to be in collaboration with my good friend Mia. I'm gonna let her not really introduce herself. I'm gonna introduce her, but I'm gonna let you get a look into her channel and what it is that she is filming for today. Okay, you guys, so this is Mia. She is one of the sweetest, most kind, loving, caring mamas I know. I am so excited to be in relationship with her. She is somebody who you will want to be best, best friends with. I know I do. Over on Mia's channel, she does beauty, lifestyle, and all things mom related. I absolutely adore her. So in my opinion, Mia is the sweetest, sweetest woman. Um, she is a beautiful mama. As you guys saw, we are doing a stocking stuffer idea video. So I am actually going to be telling you guys what I would put, what I'm not going to, but what I would put in my kids' stockings if I were making them stockings. And I am making them stockings, but the stuff that I'm telling you now is not going to vlogging, lifestyle, cleaning, and beauty channel. And if there's anything that you would like to see me film, go ahead and put it in the comments down below. If you are new here and or coming over from Mia's channel, I thank you so much. I appreciate you all so, so very much. And let's go ahead and get into this video. Alrighty, so I clearly don't have the things, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull up a little screenshot or a little picture bill right about here for the video. Okay, so I have two kids that are um, nine and ten. So I'm going to show you what I would put in their stockings first, okay? Um, so every year we do candy. We do those, you know, those chocolate oranges. We do those. Um, like deodorants, toothbrushes, all of those things, razors for the two little girls. Um, but I'm going to show you like the little things that we could be putting into their stockings. So for um, Jisha and Ellie, my nine and ten year old, their things are pretty similar. Um, so I'm just going to kind of go over them like obviously like that because doing um okay so the first thing would be pokemon cards like the little packets that you can find at the grocery store of pokemon cards so right here i'm going to show you some pokemon cards that i would put into either ellie or Dacia's stockings they would be both over the moon excited for those pokemon cards they both talk about pokemon they both collect pokemon it's like pokemon central here in our house we even still can play Um, the other thing is going to be the LOL surprise dolls, the ones that you get in those little balls. So obviously my 10 year old would like the girls and my 9 year old would like the boys. They're interchangeable. I can put either or in their stockings and they would absolutely love it just because they have a collection and if they get them that they don't want, then they 
It's a stuffed animal of some sort, and they smell so stinking good. I wish you could smell them, but you can see how cute they are right about here. Um, and I'll show you a few different variations. My kids' stockings are pretty similar across the board just because with everything that they get from Santa and everything that they get from like me and my husband and then other extended family, they really don't need for a lot of things. But I know like growing teenagers want for things. So just to hand them a gift card to Claire's or a gift card to Starbucks or whatever, you know, kind of gives them that liberty to say, hey, I want to go and pick up a pack of earrings or hey, mom, can you take me to go and get a coffee? You get what I'm saying? So just that special touch that will individualize each of their stockings is what I will do. Um, and obviously, obviously, there will be a few things that just go in here and there that I am not mentioning here. Um, but, 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 I will have a video after Christmas showing you guys the the basics of what we did get our kids and what we didn't get our kids that way you guys can see that what we did get them was not excessive and was not unreasonable and is in a very um reasonable like amount of money we don't ever go overboard for our kids just because they get what they need throughout the year and so it's kind of just um we budget and that's what they get whether it goes into being wrapped underneath the tree or into their stockings. So with all of that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. My husband's right here laughing at me, <laughs> showing me his butt. Anyways, with everything that I just said, I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you guys all for watching. Have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy Holiday. Love you guys, bye.